happy valentine as you can see i'm in red i was prepared for the valentine and in valentine i'm in a beautiful place with my sister and this you have seen in the morning as i was recording for you so we were having a prayer session from 6 to 7 a.m so that's me recording people but i prayed by the way it was just a snippet sometimes same as school but that even actually it was like 650 towards the end where they said like let me just do a little bit of this so now nico somewhere you can see it's a very beautiful place actually that when they say prayer mountain they usually mean the mountain so where we are it's not literally the mountain but it's high it has streets it's very cool they have organized everything for us so today being on valentine's i want you to spend my valentine with me so i will show you where i sleep i will take you through some of the preachings so i will record some things yes 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 and i hope that you will get blessed with me as i am blessed yeah so anything you need maybe any clarification you let me know and i'm so excited to spend my valentine with my first love who is god my father <laughs> So yes, let's go and do this. I will also give you a tour of this place. So like the field and whatever. So the whole day I will just give you the tour because today now is the day on 14th this when I'm spending the whole day here. As you saw on 13th in Nonili Park, we parked with you guys until we arrived with Akina Brian and Paris but, and my sister. And now I want to show you the tour of this place as also we, like let's do the routine of here together because personally i do not know so we are trying with you guys so that next time you come to the prayer mountain as well so yes it's good to serve the lord <laughs> it is it's never in vain it has it brings joy and peace without chaos that you cannot understand i love you so much my people As I said, as I said earlier, it's also my first time in the prayer mountain, actually at any prayer mountain. So this is the field area. So obviously here and you are to kujaga kuomba because it's so big. And I also was curious to know what is down there. So I was walking towards down that place and it's actually a bit latrine and a bathroom. I don't know who actually showers here. But at least when you're praying, you don't have to go all the way to go to the toilet. You just have to come here. So, yeah. So for those who do not know, now you know. Welcome to our morning routine. So first, call the Majimoto. Hot water is always available. No, no doro. No doro. <laughs> Yes, so come up in the baridi. You are sorted. Pia kuna hot shower. But saizi jahiti wa so. This is what we work with. Let's now go to where we take the shower. Our shower. Eh? The English is not Englishing. Kuna to ile wana tazani tuko kazi ya sulubu. Oh. Before showers, the Likuja, those who do not understand, this is how we used to carry water to the. Hey, can you say what I think about? Oh, here we remove our shoes. Line. What 
to a melan it's so dark let me show you nicely faith kuna watu pia wailevi hii ayi lala chini so nasema kuna watu hawailevi so here is where me and Fe to Nalan. Every victory, cause you say I am loved when I can't feel a thing, and you say I am strong when I think I am weak, and you say So that's basically the morning routine so the morning prayer six to seven then you groom yourself then you just arrange your things and you go back now to take tea and then yeah we'll just see we'll just see So at these prayer mountains there is actually no restriction of what you should wear or what you should, what you should just do the right thing and what you think is right because we are all adults. So here is our church. This is where we usually pray. So Faith is taking some chairs so that we can be able to sit and bask at the sun as we wait for the tea to arrive. So at around 9 a.m. that's when we take our tea. So we usually take tea in the morning and in the evening. There's no food, there's no tea in between. It's just prayer, fasting, and tea with sugar just to keep you moving. So yeah, this is Faith taking the tea as I am recording. <laughs> the tea is actually very sweet. Our God is greater, our God is stronger, got you a So immediately after tea, we go back to church and now we are, our pastor comes, preaches, we pray, we sing, like it's just like church, we're just praying, fasting, praying, fasting, reading the Bible, singing, yeah. So this particular pastor decided that he wants like we be one, like we just put the chairs aside, we just sing, praise God together, hold hands and something of the sort. So. Most times I did not record because I was in the spirit, so this is one of them. So 
for the record by the end of the day we usually have like five sessions of prayers and a pastor comes and leads us through prayers singing and also preaching i actually did not record like almost all of them i think i just recorded this one and then i was just in the spirit i forgot so yeah i hope you have an idea of what usually happens and at least because of the pastor is there it's actually easy for somebody to uh, be in prayer because you are, at no point are you relaxing or you are bored because they are actually filling you with something so yeah let's continue <laughs> In this kingdom, we don't date. We enter into radical fellowship. Our God is greater, our God is stronger. God, you are higher than any other. Our God is healer, awesome and power. So, after like uh, two hours, there's usually a small commercial break. So, this is me and Faith going to the pit latrine. So it's just uh, behind the church, literally behind the church. There is a ladies' place and gentlemen's place. So here there is also tissue, water. Uh, as in, it's literally it is nice. In short, kunata camera where you can look at yourself. So yeah. We are on a break. From? What time is it? From Saint Angelo. We were praying. Saint Twelve. We were 39. praying from nine. How many ten? From nine a.m. to seven to twelve thirty. So we are going back lunch hour. So one, we get the preaching and we pray. No, that's the agenda. <laughs> Prayer mountain na mancha maumbi. So the lunch hour preaching I actually forgot to record but this is after Faith decided to take a rest and I decided to go to the field. So this is where we sleep in a better angle in the morning. So hi my love. So we are from the prayer session. Yeah, so we have prayed, we have really really prayed. We have also had uh, the word of God. Uh, from Pastor William, actually, I forgot to feel him funny enough. And probably in the evening, we'll have a session with Prophet and Pastor Ken. So, in the mountain, basically, you just pray and you just listen to the word of God and just be filled by the word of God. So, at the moment, as you can see, I'm, I'm somewhere pretty where I was in the morning, so I'm in that field that I showed you. So, here is where people come to pray because it's in the mountain so for me tomorrow I'm actually the one preaching in my district so I'm here to uh, seek guidance and wisdom from above so I re it's really a really a really interesting I hope the vlog has really been helpful to you that you might if you can't afford to go to Nakuru Mount Hell's Gate right is it Hell's Gate yeah just come come to kikuyu kikuyu is not far from nairobi town it's only 50 shillings yeah or 70 or 100 at most just come here and seek god it has it's my second day yeah we are we are only taking tea but if it becomes too difficult for you you can actually go and take food outside and then come back it's allowed and uh, to be honest God has been my strength so it's possible nothing is impossible and I really hope that it will touch people I really hope I'll be able to make it to come here and um, so it has really been a nice experience as in it's really nice and uh, Uh, for now, I just want to read the word of God. I want to sing. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. So, I might take you through evening session, but it's just the same prayer and reading, so I might not. 
but I'm really grateful for you tuning in this vlog. So if I do not show you anything else, I hope you enjoy and I love you so much. Bye bye. So let me show you a greater view or a perfect view of where we usually sleep. So this is the first place you enter. There are seats, but also there are people who usually place their mattress there and sleep. This is the second room. Also here, people just place their mattress down and sleep. And now I went to the farthest room. So here is where we usually sleep. We are not many. Yeah, we are like 50 at most combined boys and girls. But here we are, it's just girls sleeping. Men are in another room. So yes, this is the uh, best way I can show you. So uh, right now it's 5. 30. we are actually having our other session so people are already there i'm alone over here i had a personal prayer with god and then now i was in the field now i'm here i'm just taking some few things i go back and join people so that's basically it guys and then we'll have our evening tea and then evening prayers finish at 12 so the next day or 1 a.m and then wake up 6 we praise God again and whichever. But tomorrow we are finishing at 12 p.m. I will take you through as we finish. So yeah. So this is the next day or actually the last day in the prayer on mountain. So we got some mats and sat down and we were able to talk of how our days were. So there was still a session going on but we decided we want to just stay and internalize what we have learned. So this is also a better view of the field. And yeah, so we were so excited and happy that we are done. I also want to show you this place so if you have like 500 shillings you just want a personal uh, place to stay so this is a good room uh, for men and for female just 500 shillings and this was my last outfit of that day and let's go let's go home I was so excited that I was able to finish yeah so this is just the us saying bye you can see cars leaving people parking and it was actually a good time and we were very excited that we reached this far for like two days without food hey it's, it's a miracle it's a miracle so yeah bye remember to come to house of praise house of prayer kikuyu and you will not regret that's it for my vlog i hope you enjoyed i hope you have learned if you have any question comment down below or inbox me i love you so much bye bye So we went to fish and chips as our first stop because we want good food. We were from prayers. But when we did reach 120, it was only 100 shillings. But anyway, we enjoyed our food. We were actually not able to finish because we were so hungry. And then this is the food of the fellowship that I went after that I was able to preach. And yeah, so that was how I completed my day. See you